Mumps is a viral infection known for puffy cheeks and jaw caused by swollen salivary glands. Mumps is very painful, limiting the opening and closure of the mouth and jaw. Patients often can't drink fluids, leading to dehydration and weakness. They also suffer fevers, headaches, body aches, and loss of appetite. These symptoms may not occur until two weeks after the virus has entered the body. So someone infected with mumps can easily expose others long before knowing he or she is sick, resulting in outbreaks in crowded places like schools and colleges. I saw cases of mumps when I was a medical student in India. I saw complicated cases with meningitis and encephalitis, swelling of the brain tissue. I also saw orchitis, painful swelling of the testicles. It was heartbreaking to see patients suffer, especially because mumps is preventable. Here in the United States, mumps outbreaks occur periodically. The worst recent mumps outbreak was in 2016 and 2017. We've already had 58 reported cases in 18 states this year. You can help prevent mumps by covering coughs and sneezes, washing hands with soap and water, and not sharing dirty utensils. But vaccination is the best way to prevent mumps and its complications. We recommend the MMR vaccine for children at 12 months and a booster shot at four to six years of age. If at least 90 to 95% of people get the vaccine, we can prevent mumps outbreaks. That means all of us need to have at least two MMR shots in our lifetime. We can and should protect our kids from this disease.